Hi, here are the highlights of ING's quarter in just 90 seconds. We started 2017 as we ended 2016 with strong commercial and financial results. Loan growth, together with good cost control and low risk costs, helped us to an underlying pre-tax profit that's almost 40% higher. With our wholesale bank making a significant contribution to that result. We now also have more than 36 million retail customers who are attracted by our clear and easy approach to banking, our innovation focus and our commitment to sustainability. Our latest innovation is all about sustainability. Together with one of our clients, Philips, we've created the first syndicated loan where the pricing is linked to the Philips Sustainalytics rating. And I'm proud that another of our innovations, the Baconic Payments app we launched in Belgium, has been adopted by two other leading banks there and we're planning to introduce Payconic to the Netherlands this summer with five other banks on board. And we're now fully on our way with the transformation that we announced last October to build the ING of the future. This transformation unfortunately impacts many jobs at ING, especially in Belgium. We've now agreed a social plan with our Belgian trade union partners that supports the affected employees and leads to fewer compulsory redundancies. And in Germany, our digital transformation is already resulting in an improved customer experience. It is now possible to open an account in just three fully online steps. So we keep working hard every day to provide our customers with a differentiating experience in order to ensure that they stay a step ahead. See you again next quarter.